All right, guys, this is going to be a tutorial on how to set up AYU Friends mod and how to configure it so you can invite a bunch of people off your friends list to wherever you are with one click of a button. So first, I'm just going to go ahead and load up Trove. I'm going to show you that I do not have the mod installed. Um, I'm just running the default friends list right now, and then I'll walk you through step by step on how to set it up from scratch. All right. So if I click O, um, we have got the default Trove friends list here. All right. So let's let's close out of this. Um, step one: we need to download the mod. So in the description, I'm gonna have a link to the download. We're just gonna copy this. We're just going to paste that into our browser. All right, that's going to bring this up where we're just going to click download. This is the mod. Um, all right, we got that. And now we're going to go to our mods folder on Trove. Um, if you do not know where your mods folder is, you can follow the steps that I'm about to show you. You can click the little gear here. You can click game settings. You can click, you can either, you can copy this or you can click browse and find it through there. But I'm just gonna copy that. I'm gonna open up my file explorer I'm um, sorry, you click, you put it in here. Boom, that brings us right here to where our game is installed. And we're gonna click the mods folder. If you do not see the mods folder, just right click new folder and then do all lowercase mods. But we're gonna open that up. We're going to grab the mod from our downloads folder that we downloaded. So we're going to grab that, ayufriends.tmod, drop it in there, close out of that. And now let's, uh, we can close out of this. Now we can hopefully open up Trove and hopefully the mod is installed. Hopefully when we click O to open our friends list, oh, there's a classic Trove moment. Hopefully when we click O to open our friends list, we will have the AYU friends mod installed so let's see oh hey there we go look at that the mod is installed now if if you clicked oh and it's not installed like that you're just going to click escape you're going to click mods and you're going to go to ayu friends and it'll say like disabled um it'll mean you have a conflicting mod, like another mod that's not letting it. So somewhere on your, your list here, you would see something with like a little caution sign. You would want to disable that mod and then come over back to AYU friends and click enable. But for me, as you can tell, I don't have any conflicting mods, so it's working completely fine. But if it's not showing up, just make sure you go through and disable whatever is preventing it. Now, if I click O and I want to batch invite people like I'm doing a five star farm. I'm hosting. I want to drag around 30 people, right? All you got to do is click the little lightning bolt so I can like click the these all these people here. Click lightning bolt, lightning bolt, lightning bolt. And then when I go to this lightning bolt tab I can click invite all and it invites all of them to me all at once. Right now, let me close my list and reopen it. As you can tell, all of the lightning bolts disappeared. And if I favorite people and then close it, it's it's gone again, right? And that's because we don't have a what's called a config file. We don't have a configuration file set up. So I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So every time you close your friends list, uh, you know, that stuff actually sticks because it's not very practical to, you know, keep your friends list up and not move. So and especially since you change world, do anything, it's going to close out of it. So we're going to go ahead and set that up right now. So what you're going to do is you're going to click Windows, the Windows button on your keyboard. You're going to hold that and then click R. And that's going to open up this Run 
box. You're going to type percent sign app data percent sign. You're going to hit OK. That's going to open up your roaming folder. You're going to scroll down to where you see Trove. All right, there's Trove. We're going to open Trove. Now, you're going to go to the mod CFGS folder. If it's not there, you need to create the folder and make it just like this, capital M, capital C, the rest is lowercase, mod CFGS. You're going to make that folder. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to right click. We're going to make a new text document. And we're just going to open that up. Now in this text document, I'm going to have some stuff in the description that you're going to copy paste. You need to copy paste it exactly how it is in the description. So here's what I'm going to have in the description. We're going to have from this bracket down to this number 16. We're going to paste that in here. Okay. Now we're also going to copy this. Just keep that on our copy for now. We're going to we're going to save as and we're in the mod CFGS folder. We're going to paste this name. It's got to be exactly like that. Um, this part is really, really important. You need to come to the save as type where it says text document. You do not want to save it as a text document. I'll click on that and do all files. We're going to click all files. There we go. Now you're going to save it as AYU friends dot CFGS. And we're going to save it in this, this roaming folder. I'm going to click Save. And now we're going to close out of this. We do not need that. And now, when we open up Trove, now that we have a configuration file set up, it should save our... Um, lightning bolt and our parts when we click them. So on our favorites list and our quick list, everything should hopefully save now. So we're going to go here. We're going to give out some random parts. And by the way, when you heart people, it moves them up to the top, which is very helpful, right? Because if your best friend's name starts with a Z, it could be quite annoying to find him if he's all the way at the bottom, right? So you can give him a little heart. Now it's easy to find them. All right, so I gave a bunch of random lightning bolts and hearts, and we're going to close out of the friends list and reopen it. It looks like they saved. If we go to the heart tab, they're all there. If we go to lightning tab, they're all there. And yeah, we're going to you know, close it, reopen it. We'll switch worlds, make sure it's working. A-OK. -okay. And I'll even restart my game just to make sure it's working fine. But we're going to switch worlds here. And everyone is still on my heart. Everyone's still on my lightning bolt. And if we restart the game here, we should be fine. It should save because we have the configuration file set up. So it's going to save no matter what. And like I said, this is very helpful because if you go and you are inviting you know, 20 people to your five-star dungeon, right? This way you can just click those a lightning bolts on those 20 people. All they got to do, you know, they got to be appearing online and be on your friends list. You give them a little lightning bolt, come over to the tab, and there's this invite all button, right? It's also nice because, you know, like I said earlier, if you're, if you're commonly inviting people with Zs or Ys or X or whatever, you can give them the heart and you know, then they are bumped up to the top here. So I hope this, this guide was helpful. And if you need any more help, feel free to leave a comment in the description. Or you can always swing by my Twitch and ask me any questions. I'm live Monday, Wednesday, Fridays from 6 to 10 p.m. Eastern Time at twitch.tv slash Thank you so much for watching, and 
I hope that this was helpful to you. Bye.